I definitely want to take the middle space before Greymon can. Nice and attack boosts. Bring it on, Greymon. Attack me. I dare you. Nah, he's going to take a spot. That's fair. I'm going to take this so that Rise Greymon cannot. Nice and plus two attack. Just what I like to see. Faye should destroy this Rise Greymon, like, pretty fast. I would think. Not a meteor fall. This is actually a perfect example of what I was talking about earlier with Season 5 having a lot of really good Digimon designs. I love Rise Greymon. Look at him. He's sick. It's actually great. This does more. I did nothing. Wow. I expected more. We almost got him to about half in one go. That's pretty good. Just got to eliminate these fools as fast as we can. We're at plus three attacks, so it shouldn't be too difficult. Bring it on, Skull Greymon. I dare you. We got this. Oh, hey. These are not the same Digimon you had before. You used to have a Gazimon. Also, they're all, like, really high level. Yeah, you definitely used to have a Gazimon instead of uh, all this other stuff. I guess the Gazimon became the Garurumon Black, it looks like. All right, well, that's cool. It's pretty nice that used Digimon have Digivolved and become better. I hope everyone's has then. Tidal Wave is best. Dude, Tidal Wave looks sick. I have never seen that until now. I love it. We can kill Skull Greymon next turn with Tidal Wave. Let's get some damage off on this Metal Greymon here. Start making some progress on him. So many attack boosts. It's actually insane. In hindsight, I probably should have used Hydro Water for the times three damage. Probably would have done a little bit more, but too little, too late. We're still going to get him to around half anyway, so it's fine. Metal Meteor has, like, plus three attack with it. I did so little, actually. Well, Metal Greymon probably has a really high defense stat now that I think about it. And not a very high magic stat or intelligence stat, whatever. So that's why Goodnight Moon would have done so much more. Attacking me? No, you're taking the other tin pointer. Yeah, that makes sense, honestly. I'm going to attack the Greymon. Like, double up on it. Maybe we can even take it out. I doubt it, though. And it seemed pretty weak to magic attacks, though, so maybe Sukuyamon plus Haomon with double magic attacks will be able to do the job. Let's see. Ah, it might. I think it's going to live the Starlight Explosion, but it'll be close. So close. The very next time it's in any kind of combat, though, it's done. So that's fine. Let's go, Rise Greymon. Get some more damage on you. I'm more than happy to. Use the Trident Revolver. I want to see it. I want to see the Trident Revolver. That's that's not it. How dare you? How dare you deny me my request? You nerd. <laughs> Holy Light level 2. Okay, well, you know. That's video games. Don't know what else I expected. He should, as long as I don't miss next time, I should be able to take him out next time, I think. I mean, you should just kill this Skull Greymon right here. I don't even care about taking that 10-pointer. I'd rather take out the opponent. Your plus 2 attack means nothing to me. Especially if I can get a Paralysis on you. Nope. Oh, well. It doesn't matter, because as soon as I use Tidal Wave, you're pretty much dead. I highly doubt you'll live it. And we get to see Tidal Wave again, which looks epic. Like, look at this. That's so cool. Easy knockout. One down. Good job, Waymon. Alright, well, I mean, I'm going to take out the Metal Greymon and take this 10-pointer in the process. Your plus two attack means literally nothing to me. I'm not even going to use a special move. I'm just going to normal attack you. Doesn't matter that you lived. You're not going to live three. Goodbye. 
EZ. This 10 pointer now belongs to me. Many thanks. All right, Faye, if you could actually pick up the kill here, that would be fantastic. If you don't pick up the kill, I'm going to be pretty mad about that holy light miss. Yes, the Mock Stinger victory. As long as I don't miss, this should work. Yeah, there's no way he's living a Starlight Explosion from that much HP. Goodbye. He's done it. Well done, team. Well done. Victory is ours. That is a ton of experience. I love that. Gale Storm 2 is really nice. Gives us a good uh, good AoE move. 45 for the level is very good as well. Groundramon is getting there. Matadormon is going to beat him there, man. Groundramon is not getting four levels before Matadormon gets two more. We might have Grand Drachmon before this session is over. It's a very real possibility. In fact, if we get close enough, I might just use Brave Points to get him there. I'd rather save Brave Points for Abbey training, though. I think that would be a better use of them, to use them when I'm trying to get rookies to... Or I'm trying to get champions to, like, level 25 before degenerating them. I think that's when it would be best used. I want to move... I didn't go to the organized thing. I want to move you for Matadormon. All right. What you got, Chitose? Oh, it's you. Came to ask about Ryuji, right? Sorry, but give me a minute. I'll definitely talk to you soon. I haven't checked the board. Ah, well, I I went and checked the board before, thinking that I might have some cases to do first. All I had to do was talk to Shitose, and then he gave me some. Mr. Navit of the Dead. Can I, like, can I opt out? Can I just say no? Because I really don't want to. <laughs> I actually just don't. Oh, I gotta go fight a security wall for that one. That's pretty nice. Are none of these gonna give me memory ups? No. Ah, uh, Mr. Navit of the Dead does. Thank goodness. But I have to deal with the stupid occult people again, and I hate them. Uh, I wanted to look at... We got a memory up, right? Yes, okay. So, I still got one memory up from that mission, but apparently I would have gotten two if I had chosen to save the Digimarket. So, that is a little... That's still upsetting, but it's not as bad. As it was before. So now... Which one of these do I want to do? We can lay off the green cases for a minute. We'll just leave those there for now. I think, honestly, I just want to get Mr. Navit of the Dead out of the way. Let's just do it and be done with it. It'll give me some more memory up. I really want the memory up, and I just... I don't want to mess with it. You looked into Mr. Navit before, but now we're he we hear he's at Nakano Broadway. Stop him. Boss is asking, so please. All right, let's go. I'm starting to think that it's not a singular Mr. Navit. There's actually, like, a Power Rangers group of these guys. Vice President of the Golden Dawn. That must be the nickname of the Vice President of the Occult Research Club. Why? I guess it's an investigation into Mr. Navit. I'm watching you. Oh, no. Ah! No, I won't give in to such threats. It's time to man up. To Nakano Broadway. That shrine to consumerism. Yeah, sure. Oh, hey, I'm here. What's up? Hi, thanks for accepting my case. Are you aware that your eyes are closed? May and the others? Good question. Today's the finale of that TV show they all love so much. Ah, nice. You're abandoning our investigation for a TV show. I mean, what's more important? The occult or some TV show? Definitely the TV show. A TV show, but only this time. What? Come on, it's the finale. It's the one where that word returns to the spirit world. He finally recovers his lost powers and does battle with all the spirits he's vanquished from the mortal world. Yeah, that's definitely an anime, and you know what? I can't blame them. Then he reunites with his one true love. It's going to be an awesome finale. Why are you watching this finale? It sounds like you already know everything. Did you read the manga? They read the manga. He's going back to the spirit world, and that's just where I'm going right now. See ya. You know what? The less I have to deal with the group, the better. Hey, come back. Come on, Monaka. We've got to stop her. Hey, what's the matter? I'm sorry, but I can't go with you. Huh? I have to go. My time has finally come. What? Monaco, what are you talking about? My time living among humans has been brief, but I have enjoyed it ever so much. Alas, it has now come to an end. What is... I, I hate this research club. What's going on? Goodbye, Kenji. I too must return to the spirit world. You still have much to do in the mortal realm. 
When you discover the ultimate secret in you two transform into a spirit, why do I have to read this? Make sure you look me up in the spirit world. I'll be waiting. Not Manaka, too. What do we do now, Lily? Oh, she's already gone, dude. Huh? Where did she go? She was just here. Let me guess. She also vanished into the spirit world like the other two. Now, she probably just had to go to work. So, it's just me now. Now that the others are residents of the spirit world, you're the only one I can count on. Oh, my goodness. Let's work together and reveal Mr. Navit's true form. Why not? First, let's split up and search Broadway from top to bottom. Sure. Okay, Rogue, I'll see you later. Can I, like, bail? <laughs> and still get my reward? I guess I gotta talk to some random people. Did you see that thing? Yeah, it was horrible. It was Mr. Navit, right? Uh, I don't think so. It had arms and legs, and it was slinking around. Wait, this one has arms? It took the escalator up. I wonder if it's still upstairs. Forget about it. Let's go and look at the clothes. I was actually going to go up the escalator first. They must have been talking about Mr. Navit. Indeed. It sounds like it took that escalator up. I'll go and check it out. Uh... This is getting creepy. Like, exceptionally creepy. Even by Digimon video game standards. What was that thing? <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. Was he called Super Generic Man? It was Mr. Navit, wasn't it? He's actually Super Generic Man. That's a superhero that I want in my life. Maybe, but why would he be here? For a product promotion? Probably. He was so friendly, but didn't say a word. He was really drawn to you. It was hilarious. He was so determined to shake your hand and wouldn't stop touching your body. What? And he didn't blow... Didn't he blow in your ear before he left? This is sexual assault. Yeah, I took a photo. I'll post it on Digiline. Don't even think about it. I'm serious. It seems something resembling Mr. Navit had his hands all over that good-looking guy. Mr. Navit must be in Broadway somewhere. Please, stop. I'll take another look around. Turn around, you fool. I really just want to sit down and talk to the main developers of this game. I have so many questions that need answering. And I'm sure none of their answers will be satisfactory. <laughs> he stopped really well right behind me. Hey, what's that? Why is everyone looking at me? Have I got something on my face? You mean besides the way your eyes... What? It's a ninja... What? How do I not hear it jumping up and down? Bro, have you had any luck? Unfortunately. I see. Me neither. But I've heard people talking. It sounds like he's still in here somewhere. We should meet up and review our strategy. Come to the first floor entrance. Do I have to? Oh my goodness. Ah, Rogue. Yeah, he's still right behind me. What the? But but behind you. Oh, hello there. Okay, sure. <laughs> hey, wait. He's left Broadway. We have to catch him before he hurts anyone. What are you talking about before he hurts anyone? <laughs> hurts anyone? Yeah, that's what I'm confused about. What is he going to do? I'm, oh. Oh, I know where we are. Where am I? I was so focused on chasing Mr. Navit, I'm not even sure how he ended up here. We had, uh... This is like a pathway that, le that we used... It's like a sewer system or something, I think, that we used to get underneath Kamashiro, and it's where Yuko turned into an eater in the first game? I think? I remember this area. I don't remember exactly what happens in this area. It becomes a digital shift at some point. Kenji must be up ahead. Yeah! Yo, what's up? What, it, it left its head? It's still warm. What do you mean it's still warm? He must have only just ditched it. But what's that smell? It's sickly sweet and a little spicy. Is it a woman's perfume? Ah, so it's a female. Rogue, Mr. Navid is. It might have been a woman in the costume. Or a guy who likes perfume. Whoever was inside isn't here now. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Mr. Navit should be just up ahead. Uh, it's Mrs. Navit or Miss Navit? The truth is just up ahead. Please let me find out the truth so that I never have to do another one of these missions ever again. 
It won't open. It looks like an electronic lock. Oh, no. Then I'll hack it. Yeah, let's do that. It's no use. I have to find a way to open it. There must be a way. I am an Eden hacker after all. Yeah, but if it's, like, not in Eden, can we really do anything? Oh, no, Rogue, someone's coming. Oh, is it the protagonist from the first game? Who's there? What are you doing? Now it's a security guard. Never mind. Yo, what's up? Ah, security guards. No, no, no. This is bad. This is really bad. We have to get out of here. Ah, could you act any more suspicious? What on earth? Hey, are you okay? Officers, please arrest this man. Don't people say this place is haunted? Like groans coming from the other side of the door and weird sounds tonight? These are the worst police officers I've ever seen. Can I please report them to Matayoshi and have them fired? What are you saying? That this kid is possessed? We're working. This is no time for joking around. Thank you, other security guard, for having some semblance of sanity. And then immediately losing it, it looks like. What on? He's just pumping his fist. Hello? Huh? What happened to the security guards? I hate everything about all of this. Huh? Talk about it later. Yeah, you're right. Let's get out of here. Sure. After getting out of the basement, we hung around near the entrance for a while in the hope of resuming our search for Mr. Navit. But the security guards didn't leave the door, and we were forced to abandon our pursuit. What a disappointing end. I better get my memory up. Is all I'm saying. What was Mr. Navit? The truth must lie on the other side of that door. I'm not even sure I care anymore. Although... If you dig any deeper, you're dead meat. Nothing about Mr. Navit makes any sense. Yeah, tell me about it, man. Why is one of them being Jimmykin? The performances, the standing completely still, that sinister threat, how it groped that guy. But I guess it's too late now. I get the feeling Mr. Navit will never be seen again. Oh, please, let that be true. Perhaps I witnessed the inception of a new urban legend. Or it could be more accurate to say that I played a part in its inception. Which reminds me, I haven't received payment for this case. We better. Although I actually didn't solve it, so... This has all been a big waste of time. But at least it's over now. Yep, it's all over. Something tells me that it's not over. A couple of days later. Oh, no. Hey, where are you? Mr. Navit's appeared. Just what I wanted. More Mr. Navit plus Date. And Ikebukuro, get over here. I am already here. Looks like Mr. Navid has appeared in Ikebukuro. I'd better get back to Date. Really quickly. I think I need to I need to set the Digilab guys to start searching again, don't I? Because they found a case? Yeah, yeah, I do. When am I ever going to get my third farm island? I do not remember it taking this long to get the third farm island when I uh, played the first game. Maybe I missed one of the island things somewhere. Uh, you Do you only have to level up? You also have to have 110 intelligence, which you're only three away from. So you might have to go to level 51 if you don't get three intelligence in the next two levels. But I think you probably will, most likely, since you're a brainy type. All of you are going to Mega. You have to become ultimate again on the way. You are going to go a few more levels, and I'm going to degenerate you. And you're going to Seedramon. Because you're going to Metal Seedramon. Because I might still use Apoclemon. I might pivot to Armageddon. I'm not sure yet. Got to wait for the comments to come in. You need to Digivolve? Nope. You. Nope. I'm going to Digivolve you into Lady Devamon. Stingmon. I mean, I want Dinobimon. Ideally, but I don't have an XV mon and I don't want to go through all that hassle, but whatever. We'll worry about it later. It's really not a pressing matter. What are you? Are you becoming. You're becoming this, but you, you gotta degenerate, so go back to Mud Fridgemon. That's all the Abbey you need. Now I can start Digivolving you again. What are you doing? That's Grand Dragmon. I'm not Digivolving you in a Grand Dragmon. I actually could use this Skull Satamon to get uh, Diabormon to get Armageddonmon if I really wanted to. Would that, like, be 180 attack, 130 speed? It would take some work, but it should be possible. I'll degenerate you into Devamon to get some more Abby for now. That should do it. All right. 